Okay, uh, our topic is SI unit, especially our focus is going to be on amount of substance. Now, can you remind the class what is SI unit? Yeah, SI unit is a successor to the metric system. Very nice. And how many fundamental quantity we have we learned in the class? Can you remind the class? We learned four, seven. Mm -hmm. Seven oh. fundamental quantities. Oh, seven. Fundamental. If we do have seven fundamental quantity, how many as a unit should we have associated to seven fundamental quantity? Seven. Very nice. And how many of them we already learned? Four. What are they? Uh, length, which is uh, meter. Okay. Uh, time, uh, which is second. Good. Mass, which is uh, kilogram. And then current. And then current, which is ampere. Very nice. Today we're gonna learn amount of substance, and the SI unit for amount of substance is mole. The class is finished. We can come back. No, to no, no, no. What is a mole? What is the amount of substance? This uh, nothing makes of, sense. Amount of substance. Okay, all right. Very good. So <laughs> now, good. I was testing you. So in the yeah. beginning, you took a word that memorization is a crime, mm -hmm. and you refused to memorize. Very good. All right. Congratulations. Now. Amount of substance is like amount of things. For example, uh, uh, number of eggs. So, all right, so how many of them? One, two, three, four. But instead of saying 12 eggs, because 12 eggs is a mouthful. Mm -hmm. What else you can say? Uh, one dozen. Very nice, one dozen. Okay, so how many dots of egg you can fit? And let's see how many uh, circles there are. There is 12 here, another 12 here, and 6 here. So how many dozens? dozens. How many eggs you can put here? I can put 30 eggs. Here. 30 eggs. So 30 eggs is equal to how many dozens? So 30 over 12. 2.5. 2.5. Very, nice. Very nice. But, but, but uh, the simple idea is, there are 12 eggs and instead of 12 eggs we can see we can say what one, one dozen. dozen okay so mm -hmm. instead of okay so amount of substance is equal to mole right mm -hmm. uh, as a unit for amount of substance is mole. mole so amount of substance is the number of eggs number of things number of things number of so things. it doesn't have to be egg it doesn't have to be here. It can be. It can be anything. Okay. So mole. Okay. Right. So mole is a constant. Oh, mole is the animal, not the no, constant. Not, not, not the animal. Okay, not the animal. Oh. All right. Mole is a constant. It's, mm. it's a number. For oh. example, three point one four is a constant. Instead of three point one four, what can you say? What can you call it? Oh. Pi. Very good. Instead oh. of two point one seven, what can you call it? Mole. E. Or e. Okay, good. good. Uh, instead of 6 times 10 raised to 23, you can call it? Mole. Very nice. Mm. So 6 times 10 raised to 23, eggs. Okay. Uh, it doesn't have to be eggs. 6 times 10 raised to 23, eggs is equal to how many mole? One mole. One mole. Very good. Mm. That is the name of it. Avogadro number. Avogadro number. Avocado? Avogadro. Oh, Avocado number. How many dozens of egg we have here? One dozen. How many mole we have? What is mole, by the way? Uh, six times 10 to the 23 things. X. X. Six times 10 to 23. X is equal to? One more. Mole. Okay. So how many dozen we have? Dozen of eggs? One dozen. So how many mole of egg we have? Can we fit one mole of egg over here? Uh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, my brain was off. Yeah, yeah. Uh, let me, can I start filling it in? Uh, 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 uh -huh. yeah, yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You wanna... And <laughs> Why are you are so happy? I have one mole of egg. Now it's no, time to start. You don't anymore. have one mole of egg. You have 30 eggs, which is 2.5 oh. dozens. This is not one mole? No, this is not even close. What is one mole? 
what would be one mode of things in this case a how um, many six times 10 to the 23 x x you think you think we have six times 10 to 23 x here we only have 30 so can you fit six times 10 to 23 x in this room yeah no can we can we fit six times 10 to 23 x in the whole world probably no and how many more so we egg we have not even close not even close to what one more very nice very very nice all right now since you understand a little bit let's put the understanding in action shall we okay what is this uh this is a carbon atom see this is element one of the element chemical element element and what is six represent uh number of proton very good and what is 12 represent atomic mass well, that means proton plus mm, electron neutron oh. proton plus neutron, neutron is the atomic mass, mass. Okay. so this is proton and this is proton, proton plus, plus neutron so how many proton we have six and how many neutron we have six all right now the question is very good very nice now the oh, question is yeah. Oh, uh, carbon yeah. nuclear yeah you're gonna get to see that is this carbon or yeah yeah this is carbon okay so now one mole mm. one mole of carbon mm. one of oh, one mole of dash gram mm. okay so how many one mole of carbon so this one mole of carbon is how many gram can you please find out yeah 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 so this is pretty easy so uh, i have the scale right here folks so i've been asked to put up one mole of carbon into grams so all i have to do is this is the hardest part turning on the scale so and now i'm just gonna measure the gram and Negative, that's not, negative 8. That's not how you measure it. Again, negative 8. No, 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 that's not how you measure it. You can measure this one here. Yeah? Okay. Uh, but you cannot measure this one. That's not how we measure this. It told me minus 8. No, 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 no. That's not how we measure this. So we measure it by atomic mass, okay? Okay. So one mole of carbon to our is equal to num number of atomic mass it has. So how many gram? How many grams? Six grams. Oh, what is this one? Oh, my last name, Barry. I see you're trying to compliment me. No, no, Thank this, you. this is not Barry. This is this is Boron. I wish this was Barry. Okay, but thanks. You try to make me happy. Your teacher happy. All right, I'll give you some extra credit. Uh, but this is Boron. Okay, so yeah. one mole of Boron is uh, how many gram of carbon? Oh, how many gram of carbon? Okay, so you said I have to take the atomic mass, right? Okay. So let's see. On the look at the other side, and then you can you can count the atomic mass oh. over here. This is the atomic mass. Number of proton and neutron. Neutron. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Very good. Ten. So nice. is it ten gram? All right. So the last oh, one. The, so you. what is uh, as a unit? of amount of substance moles very good what is mole mole is amount of something amount of quantity amount of quantity can it be amount of candy yeah can it be amount of electrons yeah can it be amount of x yeah if it is amount of x then how many x we have in a mole six times 10 to the 23 can it be money yeah. all right so uh, it seems like you understand the concept um uh, I have next class. You want to go home or you want to practice a little bit? I'll practice a little bit. Okay, so I'll see you tomorrow. <gasps> oh! One mole of money! Yeah! I'm richer than this! Uh, give me the, that's one mole, that's one mole. One mole of money here, one mole of money there. <laughs> give me all the money. Give me the damn money.